Hello and welcome to Technical Skills YouTube channel. This is Shwagat Ali. In the previous video, we have successfully completed our setup activity and upload the data on the Firebase. If I open my Firebase database, as you can see here in the previous video, we have successfully uploaded this data. So in this video, we will check the user existence. If user already signed in and completed our setup activity, then we simply redirect user to our home activity. And if user already signed in and did not complete it over setup activity, then simply user redirect to over this activity, setup activity. And if user did not sign in, then we simply send user to over login activity. So first of all, we will change over intent. So go to our project and first of all, open our manifest and cut this intent from setup activity and paste it inside over supply screen. If I run this application, it will open over supply screen first. Here you can see it's open supply screen and redirect user over login activity. So now here we will check if user already signed in, then we simply redirect to user setup activity or home activity. So what we will do, we will check the user existence in our side over supply screen. So open over supply screen. And here inside over runnable, we simply cut it from here. And now here first we will create the preference. So Firebase Earth, M Earth, MRF, and Firebase User, M User. So initialize it inside on create method mart equal to firebase firebase auth dot get instance and now m user equal to m auth dot get current user. Okay, now finally we will initialize over database reference. So m reference equal to firebase database dot get instance dot get reference dot child so we will check child inside this database you can see here here is the user so we will simply check if user already added the data inside this user so pass here users and here we will check if user already exists or not so uh, if m user if not equal to null if user not equal to null then we will check the second condition if user not equal to null mean our user is signing and the next condition that we have to check user already added the data under this user one this user so now m reference dot child and here we will simply pass the user id m user dot get current user sorry get uid dot add value event listener new value event listener that's it put a semicolon here now here we will check if data if data snapshot dot exist mean you user have already completed over setup activity then what we have to do we simply send user to our home activity so here we will create the intent intent equal to new intent this activity is splash screen splash activity dot this the target activity is over home activity so over home activity is not created so simply we pass here main activity dot class And start at activity and here we pass simply intent and finally finish in else condition if user not exist mean mean user did not completed the setup activity then what we have to do we simply send the user to over setup activity so copy this intent and paste it here now change this main activity into setup activity that's it in else condition if user did not exist mean user already not signing 
then what we have to do here we will create another condition else copy this intent in else condition we will send user to over login activity that is our main logic okay now run the application again okay this is our splash screen here we will check if user already exists then we send to our main activity or setup activity so i already logged in in this activity and completed over setup activity so that's why it sent us to main activity and if i remove the session mean i logged out i remove the application i mean uninstall let's create it because there is no logout button okay now I'll run the application again and let's check and let's check either the this application send the user to over login activity or main activity okay now here you can see it send us to over login activity so let's create account let's say I create any random email okay let's click on register okay it send us to our setup activity so let's close this application again and run the application again Ah, look at that now it sent us to our setup activity also we need to add our toolbar name so let's add this inside our setup activity so here we will add our toolbar I think are not created already so here we will create toolbar get support action bar dot set title and here we will pass the title is setup profile that's it and run the application again here you can see setup profile so also we have to remove this border so let's remove this border because it's not looking good select this image and go to text and here we will remove that border because it's not looking good and also remove the border width okay now run the application again okay now look at that it's looking nice okay now complete our setup okay now complete our setup activity our setup profile so click on this image and select an image let's say i select this image okay i type name and select city sorry country and type the profession okay now click on save okay it sent us to our main activity so if i close this application and run the application again okay you can see here main activity is open 
so everything good to go so please like my video share my video and subscribe my channel thanks for watching see you next video take care bye